Einstein, in developing his theory of general relativity, said that, that the universe was like what? An exploding grenade. Explain that. Well, when he solved his equations of general relativity, he saw that it predicted a beginning for the universe and an expansion of the universe from that beginning. So that was the very start from a scientific perspective of the Big Bang explanation for the origin and development of the universe. All right, so what they're saying is they were looking for this. Guys all the way back into the 20s had postulated this. Einstein had done it through mathematics. But then they did certain experiments in the 90s, 92, with the Kobe satellites and found out that it was exactly what they were postulating, and it led them back to the fact that the Big Bang must have actually occurred. Now, let's give the folks at home from your, your beautiful video documentary. It's Journey Toward Creation. Folks, here's what Einstein said in real simple language. I want, to watch, I want you to watch the pictures. Just watch over here. We are passengers on a controlled and purposeful explosion. As if we are microbes riding on a piece of shrapnel from an exploding grenade. All of the universe's matter and energy, even space and time, came into existence in a single moment. But far from a chaotic explosion, this initial blast seems to have been finely tuned, as if it has been designed to benefit us and our tiny planet. Today, our knowledge of the heavens and the earth and the forces influencing them is greater than that of all previous generations combined. And our sense of wonder grows with each new revelation. You. We, we, we snuck the verse in Genesis 1-1 in that clip. So many people, some people might say, well, hey, you guys are sneaking religion in there. We're talking science. Was it okay for us to say in the beginning God created off of the Big Bang? Very appropriate. It was seven different Bible authors that wrote in great detail about the Big Bang characteristics of the universe, uh, that it has a transcendent beginning in the beginning God created, that is continuously expanding. That's the most detailed information you have in the Bible about the universe and the universe gets colder as it gets older. Job says God alone expands the universe, which means that there is this exquisite design in the expansion of the universe. And it was in the 20th and 21st centuries that scientists have discovered that what the Bible has been saying for thousands of years is scientifically accurate. 